everyone, my name is Jane and I'm a playsetter at home. Today I'm going to take you through a multi-skilled game of knots and crosses. Now, it's really simple to play this game. All we need to do is we need to set up a grid on our floor. So I've used some hula hoops and a couple of cones, but if you're outside you could use chalk to make a little hashtag sign, or if you've got colourful tape lying around the house, that's fantastic. You're going to need different colours of different things, so you could use different colours of bean bags, different colours of balls, but I'm going to use different coloured socks. So I've got a white sock and a black sock. And to win this game, all you need to do is you need to make three in a row. That could be diagonally, it could be straight, or it could be along the way. Now, I'm going to talk you through the different ways that we can play this game. You can play it by yourself, you can play it with your brothers or sisters or your grown-ups, and we've got different ways that we can place our socks into our grid. So I'm going to start off with our nice simple one, or with as you call it, to hold your colour, and you're going to hop and you're going to place it into the other one. It's then going to be the other person's turn, they will then hop and place theirs in another one to try and block you making three in a row. Another alternative that we can do is you can pick a starting place and you can balance it on your head. So we've got to balance and block and place it down to try and make our three. Our third way that we can play it is just if we stand far enough apart and we have to throw our sock into our area to try and make three in a row. Try and see if you can win any games. Remember you've got to make three in a row. It can go sideways, straight or diagonally. Have fun.